Hello there, everybody, and welcome to this episode. And as I have been sharing, one of the most important things that I have also learned when I work and provide coaching and consulting with these great and rich people that run businesses, one thing that I have learned from them that they do in such a powerful way is they understand what they want and build a system on how to get it. They build a system to make it happen. It is one thing to know what you want, and it is another thing to build a system to make it happen. It is one thing to be excited. It is one thing to desire, but it is another thing. But the two have to go together. Understand what you want and build a system to make it work. If there is one thing, that the rich and the successful have grown to do that I, I i see many people don't do around is is this particular principle of combining these two what do i want and how do i build a system to make it work because uh, I'm, I'm wanting is not enough wanting is good understanding is good but i need to make it work i need to achieve it now one of the principles, if you have read the book, um, Think and Grow Rich by, by Napoleon Hill, one of the principles to think and grow rich is desire, the principle of desire, which is, um, which states that the starting point of all achievement is desire, according to that book. The starting point of all achievement is desire. The starting point of all achievement is to understand what you want. Right? This principle explains further that with this desire, it puts you in a position where you have a defined goal, a defined understanding of what you want, and you pour all your energy and effort in achieving it. That's the power of understanding what you want. You pour all of your energy, all your effort, all your commitment to make it work. Now, this means that the rich have a clear goal in mind and then they create a plan. They create a system to achieve it. They, they don't only talk about the goals, but they create a system. They build a system to achieve it. They don't just rely on luck, on chance, on, 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 on grace as Christians who say it, but they go further. They take control of their lives. They take control of their careers and their businesses, and they build and work on that system to make their dream a reality. The core thing here is building the system to make it work. That is the core thing. Now, what does this system imply? This system can include things like building and possessing a certain character you have developed a certain character. You have developed certain behaviors because of what you want to achieve. I always say that based on what you want to achieve, based on your dreams, there are certain things you stop doing, not because those things, uh, um, not because it is a sin, but because you know that where you are going requires a certain character, a certain behavior for you to achieve that which you desire. And that, that, that involves building a system around your life to make your dream happen. Now, look at where you're going. Look at what you want. Have you developed the character, the behavior to achieve that which you want? Another thing here is about this system is building, possessing a certain daily routine. Daily routine and habits involve this system. When you understand what you want to achieve, you can develop a, a daily routine around this system so you can achieve that which you want. For example, your routine could be that based on what you want to achieve, you will start waking up every morning at 4 a.m. and you're going to study from 4 a.m. to 6 a.m. And every month you're going to read at least two books in your industry. You're going, you, you build a routine, you build a system because you need to work on this system so you can accomplish that which you want. Another thing about building the system is you identify what resources do I need to have and how will I use these resources to 
contribute to the accomplishment which I desire. That's part of the system. Therefore, successful individuals, rich people, build systems, build processes to streamline their efforts and maximize efficiency. They are not everywhere. If you want to stop being everywhere and you want to really maximize efficiency and achieve that which you desire, then one of the secrets is build systems from character to behavior to routine to resources and focus on maximizing efficiency with the system that you have developed. And one thing about system is it helps you to focus on high value activities. What are high value activities? Anything that you do that directly has a significant impact on the goal, on the achievement that you desire to achieve. Don't only desire, don't only understand. Yes, spend time to understand what you want. Don't be everywhere. Spend time. What do you want in your career? What do you want as an entrepreneur? What do you want from your life right now? That's why spend time, write it down, write your life objectives, write your career vision, write your business vision, know what you want, but take it a step further. Build a system to make it work. Build a system around your character, your behaviors, your daily habits, your daily routine, your resources, your energy, your time. Build systems around this. Enforce the system with self-discipline and give yourself consistency and some time. In two years, three years, five years, ten years, you will be proud that you made the decision to build a system and to dedicate yourself to work on this system. Keep building that dream. And of course, you are rare and you are remarkable. Cheers.